what is Chris Tales? Chris Tales is a JRPG with a time traveling mechanic. What does this mean when you actually play it? Well, it basically consists of two modes of gameplay. One is puzzle solving using a time traveling mechanic and the other is turn-based combat. We played through the first hour of this game so we can give you a general idea of what the gameplay is like. The game starts with the turn-based combat where you have options to do a regular attack. You can also use your future time travel powers to send enemies into the future to age them or send them into the past. And you also have skills similar to magic and other JRPGs. The combat also uses timed button prompts to increase your damage or parry attacks. Think of like Super Mario RPG or the Paper Mario series. Besides combat, there's a vivid overworld to explore with plenty of NPCs to talk to and plenty of items to get. The overworld is also where we see the time travel mechanic in full effect. About 20 minutes into the game, you get your time travel abilities, which split the screen into three sections where you can see the past, the present, and the future. Puzzles are solved by taking glimpses into other time periods, past or future, and also you have a frog that can bring back items from the past or future to solve the puzzle and progress the story forward. One last thing I wanted to note about this game is the great art. If you're into games with a unique art style and a great visual aesthetic, then this may be the game for you. What we saw from the first hour was pretty beautiful and I imagine the game continues with beautiful art throughout. With just an hour of gameplay, we probably just scratched the surface, so we're gonna get a little more gameplay in future videos to give you a better idea of what this game entails. But without further ado, here is the first hour of Chris Tales. Holy Mammoth Crew here doing our first look of Chris Tales. First look, Brand first impression, game. first time playing Chris Tales. Oh my gosh, we just got it on Xbox Game Pass. So if you have Game Pass, it's available to download right now. Go get it. If you have another system, I believe it's like 30 bucks. Oh. We just start off with action? Oh yeah, stuff's on oh, fire. Oh, whoa, okay. Yeah, we didn't show the it's intro like, what movie. Happened? I may throw the intro cinematic at the end because you can see what's going on. Uh, so it's an RPG, so we got some turn-based combat coming up here. Japanese RPG. JD just learned that term, Japanese RPG. Today. Yeah, I just learned that, <laughs> I'm totally man. calling it out. <laughs> Jay's like, I was no, like, shh, don't tell him. <laughs> <laughs> what? No, I'm not ashamed. I was just like, what's the J stands for? JRPG. I'm like, Japanese? Okay. I get it now. Yeah, you That's got it. it. Okay? Jeez. That's it. Jeez. But yeah, we played a lot of them. So yeah, yeah you, I mean, JD so yourself has played a lot of them. Yeah, Miss yeah, yeah. I this is like PS. by way of Final Fantasy or Chrono Cross or whatever. Miss, I love Dark Cloud. When are we going to play Dark Cloud? When are you going to get out your PS2? I want to play Dark Cloud. Let's go back to the classics. Well done, Chris Bell. Yeah. Chris Bell. Chris Bell. Well, she holds her sword up like it's the Thundercats or something. Thundercats, go! Mighty Morphin Thundercats. Okay, who are you supposed to be? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Crossing universes. All right. The turtles, Power Rangers, and Thundercats should all be in the same universe. Uh, so this is to practice, so you can tell you've got some turn-based combat. I would say, from what I've seen so far, very similar to Paper Mario. Uh, if you've ever played any of the old turn-based Paper Mario games. Because you have button prompts that let you do like double damage like that. Uh, okay. uh, if you get the timing right. That's his weapon, the shield, and it splits apart, and he, uh... Yeah. <laughs> I mean, okay, you, you're like, oh, that's his weapon, the shield, it splits apart, but when Captain America pulls out his shield, you're like, oh my god, that guy with the abs has such a nice shield. <laughs> <laughs> it's for the ladies. <laughs> for the ladies. Does he even show his abs in the movie? He must, right? That's uh, how they, that's yeah, how they when get... he first becomes Captain America, he does. That's true. I think yeah. every male superhero has to show his abs at some point, right? No. Nah. They kind of be like, I gotta get those ladies oh, at the theater somehow. Who are these? I've been chasing those things since I left St. Clarity. We've got to stop them before they uh, reach town. They look so and much exactly bigger than your characters. Yeah, they're huge. They won't get past us. 
Look, volcano. They broke our poor goblins. How adorable. So, I believe this game is fully voice acted. Daddy, we've talked wow, about yeah. this. No more pets until... It's a lot back and forth Can there. Can I stop murdering them? I know, I know. I just want to play. Not my fault they're all so squishy. Squishy. <laughs> and that's why we can't have nice things. Oh, A little bit of punchy dialogue. Uh, okay. So, we don't have any skills yet. What's I'm that her we're going to get that later. One of them's got something on their face. Yeah, it looks like her eye turned into a rock or something. No. Oh. Or a crystal, maybe? Didn't that happen to one of our characters in Wildermyth? Oh, yeah. Calling back yeah, to another watch one of Wildermyth. our uh, We've been playing that. Got some episodes on that. And by the way, if you... Um, like what you're seeing, like and subscribe. Oh yeah, subscribe. Like and subscribe. If, if you subscribe, I'll be your best friend. <laughs> wow, such a promise. I'll be like, well, do you know how if you do like a Kickstarter, you get different tiers of rewards? So if you subscribe, you get to rename our channel to whatever you want. Just kidding. Okay. Really? You sure about that? We got such square shaped trees in this world. <laughs> uh, so geometric. Yeah, I got some. This actually reminds Narrow me a lot tone. of if you've ever seen Sleeping Beauty. The style, of the background, and the animations look a lot like this. I was gonna totally say that. Were you really? <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say that when yeah. you see Dis the Disney <clears throat> version, animated version of Sleeping Beauty, it's like that. The trees all squarish and whatnot. Yeah, it had that distinct style of animation. Strange uh, words, half circular hills. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and we got very much Papa book style in the world here. Wait, yeah. My rose. So very, in my mind, Paper Mario. Have you ever played any of the old Paper Mario mm -hmm. games? Especially uh -huh. like N64, the GameCube one. Uh, the art looks different because, you know, Paper Mario is so vibrant. Mario based, but that style of like being in a really vibrant Papa color. Book. Yeah. Yeah. Very vivid, vibrant color. Okay, so use the. I'll stick to move around. Um, I don't think the controls are too complicated in this game. So she, she called her mother Chris superior? Oh Fine. yeah, there's a mother superior. Did Isn't that like religious or something? Yeah, she's clearly a nun. That's why she's got uh, tattoos under her really eyes. Really? She looks like a sexualized version of uh, Mary Had a Little Lamb or something, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> or Bo Peep? <laughs> 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 like the, the Mary Bo Peep or the Mary Had a Little Lamb porno. Yeah, she superior. even got like vampy makeup or something. And be careful. I worry about you. Yeah, she's got very vampy makeup. Um, eh? Very intricate <laughs> outfit for her there. Uh, but yeah, they did a nice job with the character designs. The only problem is I'm getting a lot of screen tearing. Um, I didn't see an option to turn on V-Sync, so... I don't know if that's going to get in the capture, but I'm definitely seeing a lot of that so far in the game. Oh, uh, I see it now. Yeah. Ooh. They should have yeah. vertical sync, an option to turn it on. They might want to fix that. Uh, yeah, but this is the first day it's out, so maybe it'll be fixed soon. Uh, I guess we could talk okay. to more people, see what they're up well, to. Well, it's had a ton of awards from E3 and GameCon. Yeah, I wonder, I don't know if this game was out in early access or demos, but I know it just came yeah, out today. Yeah, I think there was a preview set on their release. website. Modus nice. games. And how it used to be around here. Yeah, you were reading that they were inspired by Chrono Trigger, uh, Final Fantasy, and you know, a bunch of other big RPGs. Yeah, classics, other type of, um, like Persona 5 and things like that. Uh, okay, press Y to check your current. It's like a fairy tale story, too. Yeah, and the music sounds... It's weird because it says it's supposed to be a dark fairy tale, but the music sounds so Disney. Oh, maybe it'll change. Oh, um, well, So right we'll now, it, it sounds like... Okay, the music sounds like the, the music you hear like when you go to Disney World. <sighs> that Marco is never For cold. sure. He will inherit this one day. He should help me take care of it. I guess she likes to refer to her baby as it. <laughs> She's it's like, it's baby. a monster and I'm giving it to my husband. I want no <laughs> part of it. <laughs> it's baby. Take this baby. Think about the future. It's not just the farms that will be renovated. It's the orphanage, the shops, the whole town. Your yeah, future? that voice doesn't quite match. Yeah, it character. sounds like it should have been older sounding, right? Like he has a nice deep voice. Right. Power 
Because he looks like an older person. That's all you care about now. How dare you? Where's your proof? proof. How dare you? Oof. Look around you. Some words here. So much for fairy tale. Right. <laughs> lands, Robert. Don't let it trouble you any longer. It's what's best for the town. You know who he sounds like? It's like uh, Matthew some, Broderick. But not the town. Oh yeah. <laughs> you seem to be doing Bjorn. just fine. Especially yeah. when he was doing that character in the producers or something. See here. Which we, we didn't even finish watching that Mr. movie. Mayor, oh no, we, we didn't finish the new producers. Hello, yeah. Chris Bell. What do you want? Hello, Miss Lana. She's nasty. I, I don't like her. What do you want? Mm, like, bitch, please. I'm here to talk. Try the northern fields. That's where all the little pests go, hmm? May the lady light your way, Crisbo. Too many in town have strayed from her grace. Oh, thank you. I should go. Okay, so we have the mayor arguing with the farmer. Apparently the mayor did something. Just hinted at some kind of... That the farmer don't like. Well, apparently he wants to buy up everybody's land and then pretend to fix the, the town. At least he's promising to fix the town. Yeah. So, so who we'll knows see. if that's all true. We'll see what that's about. I really only played like 10 minutes of this game. But I got past that part. Um, so, like, they don't explain what exactly Chris Bell is. She's in an orphanage or something? Because uh, she's yeah, she uh, is Mother an Superior. Orphan. So I guess we started in media res and now we're going back to back in time to how that all started because she was like a badass warrior in that part right like a sword well it does explain uh, in their sight for... that you get to look at the past and then you make decisions in the present time and it affects the future so you're manipulating the past present and future to the different kind of gameplay yeah. hi polly I don't know, Chris. I don't know. Sounds so She's such a miserable. Seemed really angry. Or her oh. dad was the farmer. Then, I keep telling him to trust the mayor. We need his soldiers to protect us. But it's always we give the lady our trust. Everyone else has to earn it. Sorry, Chris. Okay. What's up? I need my frog. A little yellow frog. He was wearing a hat, a top hat. He took my rose. Is that her pet, the, the frog? Because I saw him hat. earlier. Yeah, he was Christmas. giving us the tutorial I in the battle. Seen it, but I'll keep my eyes the frog talks. Yeah, he talks. <laughs> I didn't even realize Maybe that. Pray to the lady about it. Pray to the lady. <laughs> Who's the lady? The lady's supposed to be God or something? Well, uh, me, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't notice them talking about that in the website. Lady. This whole Lie game guy. is like a religious allegory. It's like, oh, we all need to pray. There's your frog. And all of a sudden she starts talking about Jesus. I'm like, I gotta go. I see the frog over here. <laughs> There's my frog. So, Bye. She's like, have you let, to, let the Lord into your life? And you're like, um. <laughs> let I the lady into your this. life. <laughs> you mean Mother Superior? She's in my life. Mother no, Superior. the lady, the lady. The, the lady. lady with a capital L. Ooh. Something's happening. Oh, it is froggy. What's up? Uh, okay, I guess I can move around. Uh, what do I want to do? I don't want to leave. Oh, there's my rose. Rose was added to your bag. Thank you. There goes that stealing frog. That frog looks like the frog from Looney Tunes. That was saying. Oh, Michigan J Frog. Yeah. It's like, hello, my baby. Hello, right? my darling. Hello, <laughs> my ragtime right girl. Exactly. <laughs> he would drive the guy insane because he'll sing when nobody's around, but then when he tries to show him off. <laughs> or he I felt stays so bad quiet. for that guy. Yeah. It's like, you know, I know it's supposed to be funny, but then I just end up feeling bad. <laughs> uh, okay, so what's happening here? Okay, so some kind of vision of the future. Who's doing this? Uh oh. Actually, you are. You have opened the crystals of time, Chris Bell. Oh. Uh, where, uh, I mean, who, how do you know my name? First thing to say, they're talking frog. <laughs> Matthias the frog at Matthias. your service. 
I have been keeping an eye on you for some time now. Well, that's creepy. I've been watching you while you sleep. Hi. And change uh, your clothes. Change your clothes. Take a I've been bath. watching you when you think you have your alone time in the evening. I was correct. <laughs> <laughs> More questions. <laughs> it's like too many damn questions. Have revealed themselves to you. Come, see for yourself. Okay, so this is a time travel thing. I don't want this. Oh, Nothing just to fear, child. You have much to learn about your powers. Is it? Powers? This is a curse. <laughs> Why is this even happening? You are upset. Perfectly understandable. Is he like but Jiminy Cricket? Who can help. He does sound like Jiminy like Cricket. Right. The lake. Even the voice sounds super similar, right? She would be very worried if she saw you like this. Is it another talking frog? <laughs> if only, but sadly, no. Trust me, little one. Let us go immediately. I mean, you're little too. You're yeah, frog. I mean, you're actually smaller than me. Little. Uh, okay, so this has the was that the trope? That will not help, Chris Bell. Please, let us go to my oh, friend. he's gonna keep uh, you from doing yeah, what you want to do. Yeah, which way am I supposed do? to go? Down here, he's I was even fully paying What's attention. What's this triangle thing? We are almost there. I think I'm in some kind of time portal? I don't know. Uh, it's like a spotlight. <laughs> right, it's just... Yeah, it does look like a spotlight shining down on me. Uh, I guess I go through here. Um, but yeah, it has the, the hero's trope. You can save your game on overworld, just open the menu screen and select save. Got it. Remember to save often. Like Everything's an exclamation mark. You have to be like, you can save your game! Save! <laughs> okay, we save. Yeah, it has the, like, the hero's journey trope where she has to refuse the quest first. And be uh -huh. like, I don't want this. Why, yeah. Why are you like, giving no, this? No, this is a curse. Dude, the Luke Skywalker, he's like, I don't even want this. And he's pushed into it. Right. Give him a big shove. Because that's exactly what people say when they get cool time manipulating powers. They're like, this is a curse. I don't want it. Not like, oh, sweet. And they're like, oh, yeah, awesome. <laughs> right, this is what I always wanted. Oh, it's like a little baby tree in the thing. Oh, I see. See, check it out. Adult tree. Baby tree. Oh. See, this is the past. And that's the future. Oh, wow. Oh, look at that. Okay. I get set. Oh. Well, I'm just gonna Frog can be nasty. I'm busy. Okay. I'm busy playing door, Fortnite. Go away. <laughs> Ooh, this frog got. He's got snappy. Mm. Huh. <laughs> Idiot frog. So. Yeah. So. Uh, so cranky there. You're right. You're a child. Manners. You're speaking to a revered time mage. What is she not a child too, or? Am I confused here? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, you're just a child. I'm like, uh, so are you. Ridiculous. Impossible. Why not even I have been able to? Yet it has happened. To. No. No, no, no. There's something else at work here. And so I'm jealous. What's going on? She's like, Patience. what are you talking about? I am Wilhelm the Wise. You, it seems, are a time age. As am I. And while my powers have led to my youthful appearance, yours are the <laughs> gift to see possibility. Possibility? I thought it was the future. Incorrect. It is a possible future. Perhaps a practical Crafting. demonstration will help. Take this seed okay. and plant it over there. He's like, I was going to make a dirty joke there. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Take my seed and put it in there. <laughs> So like how inappropriate this is a curse i want to go home oh so now it's like little flowers whoa where oh, did you go gives you a tree with fruit now oh nice Tell okay me, what do you see in the future a tree it's growing from the seed i planted uh, well that's what naturally a happens fruit tree to be specific but take care it will only grow if you care for it Otherwise, it will wither and die. Naturally. So if I do something in the present, I can affect the future. Marty, this is Naturally. incredible. <laughs> been the case. Now, however, you have the ability to see future possibilities. So choose your actions accordingly. I feel like this would have been better if it was Doc from uh, Back to Future doing the voice. <laughs> well, you know, it's funny because the have... trumpet parts of the music sounds kind of like yes, yes. Back, Back to the Future, future things. It does. You've yeah. Me yeah. Much to ponder, young mage. So, 
Marty, we gotta get back to the future. So behind, so to the left of me is the past. I'm in the present, and then the right hand side is the future. See? Isn't that cool? Cool. So there you go. That's how the game works. Oh, okay. Uh, so I said, said I need to go back, right? Go, I believe that's what back. they said. You have hint options too there. Oh yeah, it tells me. Yeah, okay. Okay, perfect. So yeah, I don't have to ever get stuck. That's oh, like okay. in those hidden object games when JD is so <laughs> um, adamant not to use the hint. I'm just like, so you use the hint so I we can know where to go. I get lost and I'm like, uh, so yeah. You're like, I can, we can figure it out. We can do it. And I'm like, ugh, I don't care. Just use the hint. <laughs> Excuse me, talking about snappy. Mm -hmm. I'm a snapping I don't care. turtle today. Just use it. I don't Let's get care. going. I love it. That was some kind of pop for you. Uh, all right. Ugh. Is this Mother Superior? No! How could this happen? Matthias, what? What's wrong? What? Oh, she's looking at the possible future and seeing everything destroyed. I guess. I guess that's what she's worried about. Frisbell, you had me worried. Mother Superior, you're okay. I almost opened my eyes, I was so worried. <laughs> well, of course. What's got you so excited, child? Did something happen? No, I mean, not yet. I went to get my rose, then Matthias showed me how I could... Matthias? <laughs> You're gonna be talking nonsense now. Here. I need to find him. At least give me the rose you spent all morning looking for. I need to get going. Yes, I need to go to the Hot Topic and get more eyeliner. <laughs> <laughs> get some more fake eyelashes. And don't yeah. take all day. You still have to prune these roses. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, she's so bossy. Uh, what did she say? Matthias? I have to go find him. Yeah. She uh, said, don't take all day. Oh. So many chores. The kids in town get to go out and play. Oh, so oh my god. I gotta uh, do chores. Sweeping sucks. Actually, that sucks. Sorry. <laughs> that does like Mother's Get a Roomba. It's kind of uh, annoying. Uh, where is that frog? I guess he's in town somewhere. Who's that on the ground? Over here. Someone pruning roses. If I pick every strawberry right now, maybe I won't have to do it ever again. I should make all these kids do chores and all of them hate it. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have to do chores as a kid? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, sure. Oh, you have to wash the dishes. Yeah. Fold the clothes, dishes. I thought it best not to upset your mother superior with the appearance of a talking frog. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Crispell? I am sorry if I upset you by leaving. No. I mean, yes, but it's the orphanage. I saw its future. Abandoned. Empty. How could that happen? Mm. That's going to mean all the children have parents. I How terrible. Know, <laughs> they finally got adopted. <laughs> yeah. Everyone's in a loving family. This is awful. <laughs> we need you to want stop them to stay it. here forever. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, okay. I guess. What a lovely day for a walk in the woods. Uh, oh, I was like a little kid. I turned into an adult. Hey, Chris. If you see my mom, don't tell her where I am, okay? Or are you just standing in the middle of nowhere? Oh, Marco. Oh. What? Wait, what? Wait, what? What's what her problem? What is she having that stroller? Huh? That was weird because it was a lady with the stroller was looking for Marco. And she's like, it'll be his one day. Is she talking about a, a kid? I guess so. So everybody's got Latin names because the company's from Colombia. Only in the future, and only if you let it So happen. we can change the future. Uh, we got powers. No, you're right. What if you met a character named Pitbull? <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Um, yeah, what is that? So she says... Excuse me, Mrs. Miller? I think your house has a rot problem. <laughs> really? That's strange. The carpenter would have told me something about it. Maybe yeah, I'll the carpenter is a liar. Maybe we That's a weird thing for a child right to tell somebody. Right. Your house has rot. <laughs> uh, yeah, you should check out your roofing. Hey, do you need a good roofer? I can, uh... 
Uh, okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, this part's really bad with the screen turn. Isn't it a dead end here? Oh, yeah. Guard. He's not really doing much of anything. He's wearing a mask in the future. Uh, okay, so what they do upgrade the, his the uniform. Go? Oh, we gotta talk to the carpenter. Uh, we gotta talk to the mayor. Maybe he's got something useful to say. This will be the new face of the town. Nah, he's nope. still yammering about the okay. town. Nothing useful there. I guess I gotta find the. Carpenter. He's not gonna be in the future, huh? Uh, I guess not. Maybe he's the back. Why would someone do this? Um, excuse me. I think your shop has rot problems. I don't have time to worry about that right now. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, it sounds like rot, she's got problems. The over to the west. Yeah, okay, so she's definitely not the carpenter. Okay, so let's find the carpenter. Is this him? Maybe. Oh, yeah, yeah Carpenter Joe. Yeah, good morning, I guess. <laughs> <sighs> He's having a day, too. <laughs> a problem? Great. What did you see, girl? They got rot. They're rotting away from the inside. In a few years, there won't be anything left. You saw rot on the inside. From the outside? <laughs> <laughs> you don't believe me. Like someone's been telling you stories about Ash Blight. Happened back when I was a Ash kid. Ash Blight? Would have lost most of the town if the old apothecary hadn't brewed up a batch of green leaf tonic. Back to the apothecary? Do I look like an apothecary? Oh my god. Uh, the these people are from Miami. Charming fellow. <laughs> this is like when you call Comcast customer support and they're like, oh, I need to put you in touch with the sales department. And then the sales department's like, oh, well, we need to put you in touch with the <laughs> they IT They bounce department. you around with different departments, wasting your time. Yeah, it's like, yep. oh, you need to talk to these people. And you're like, no, don't put me on hold. And then you're on hold for another 45 minutes. Someone tore the label off of my mushrooms. That sounds bad. I guess. Bad. It's terrible. One of these is red button. Good for digestion, great on a salad. One of them is ground death cap. Even the tiniest bit could be deadly. <laughs> of course, with no and they're labels, next to each other. To tell them apart. Just like, throw both of them why? away. I don't know why I put the poison and the medicine right <laughs> next to each other. But. Yeah, right? <sighs> put the poison next to the digestibles. Straight. Right. Of course. It's like we'll that, uh, what was that P. Holmes joke where he talks about boysenberries? He's like, we named the we berries. Don't why didn't we name the poison berry? <laughs> <laughs> it's like a hard P away from uh, killing someone. <laughs> I wish I could help. Me too. It'd be nice to have help around here. Since Dad died, though. I gotta bring him back. He's like, talk to Doctor Frankenstein. He'll bring my dad back. <laughs> That's how you could be helpful. I can right. connect Sorry. you with uh, Doctor Frankenstein. Yeah, he'll, he'll bring my dad back. Yeah, the the reanimator. I need you to go see the reanimator. <laughs> I suppose they do. Let me try something. Ugh, I can't see them in the past at all. Allow me. He's gonna eat the oh. mushrooms. <laughs> <My tice>. Try <laughs> both these mushrooms. We'll see which. One <laughs> uh, press X to prepare a time hop, then press the uh, left stick to the back to make Matthias hop in the past. Let's oh, he's doing the time different. walk. Or just say time hop. <laughs> Oh, so he's gonna turn into a tadpole. Which mushrooms are which, I guess. Uh, I guess so. he is like a tadpole. Just yeah. A little nudge. What the? Uh, okay, so now we know which ones are poison and which ones. <gasps> Red cap is poison. Blue cap is not poison. Ah, there. Okay, so how do I go back? So the red cap is poison, blue cap is not poison. Why would someone do this? So oh, we got it for you. Why would so uh, what happened? Why would some oh, what, what am I supposed to do? Okay, wait. Go back to the past. Put the label on. Well, this one has a skull on it. I imagine this is the death cap. Okay. okay, smart. How to press X to prepare a time map and then press A. Okay, so I, I just jumped ahead. I had to actually look at it. Sticker. I saw it today. Some kids were playing with one. Uh, okay, so let's hop, time hop back to the present. Let's find the kids that were playing. I think they were over here. Playing with the cool sticker. Check out the cool sticker we found. It's a skull. Give it to me, you idiot. You <laughs> Do you know what you've done? It's uh -oh. only a sticker. You can't just take 
things from stores. Especially not he probably the stole that popsicle too. <laughs> It's like, oh, okay, okay. We don't have to return this money to the bank, do we? <laughs> you just want the sticker, right? Not the money. <laughs> yeah. I haven't done any combat yet. So the beginning of this game is kind of slow. We haven't really gotten into any combat no, yet. It's just story uh, development here. So I got to take the sti sticker back to the past and put it no, into the future? Uh, you got to put it in the present, no? Do I got to talk to her? Ta-da! Where did you find it? Some kids took it. They just thought it was a cool skull sticker. I don't think they meant any harm. Of course they didn't. <sighs> What's done is done. Sigh. We'll talk to their parents <laughs> about this later. Oh shit, you're in trouble. Thank you, Chris Bell. I really appreciate all you've done. <laughs> you're in trouble. Trouble, trouble, trouble. This might be a good time to ask her about the tonic. Give me that tonic. Does the apothecary Spell. hear the frog talking? I guess not. Maybe it is. <laughs> Maybe the ending of this game will just be that you're insane the whole time. Unfortunately, be like, uh... Well, I know nobody heard or saw Jimmy Cricket, so... <laughs> so we need to get some glow fruit. That was back in the hut. Yeah, maybe it'll be like um, Shutter Island, where you're like, no one believes DiCaprio. Everything, all this crazy stuff is going on, and then you find out he's insane in the end. <laughs> hallucinating everything. <laughs> she knows Belongs in a sane asylum. Might get lucky. Okay, Magna by the Cathedral. Get lucky. Uh, I gotta talk to everyone. This gotta be Magna over here, right? This is Magda. Good morning, Mrs. Magda. Do you know if there's any glow fruit growing nearby? Miss June thought you might. They used to grow by the lake, but I haven't seen one in ages. The seed you planted for Wilhelm, it was glow fruit. <gasps> I'm sorry, dear. If you find one, let me know. They're beautiful. Blowing, Blue, purple. purple, and orange. And they, and they get you really high. Or so. <laughs> really lovely. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Mrs. I like Yay. to just put on a just Pink Floyd you. album, eat some glow fruit, and just chill. Chill. Uh, okay, so I need to go back out this way. She's like... Okay, so we're gonna go get that glow fruit. Glow, glow fruit. fruit. Wasn't there another, like, game that had something like that? Got glow fruit? Uh, Sounds familiar. Maybe? Like I've heard this term in another game. Yeah, I don't know. Probably. There's the tree I planted, but the fruit is going to take forever to grow. Then perhaps we should skip ahead, oh. or rather, I will. Okie dokie. Such okay. manipulation. So this is kind of all still the tutorial area. Go into the future. Okay. Oh, you're such an old frog. Here it is. Okay, go fruit, bring it back, and give it. You did, did it. It's not yeah. it will have to do. Okay, so let's go give that to the apothecary. Is that? I guess that is a lake behind me. Oh, so it's true. It did grow by the lake. She was right. Why did she <laughs> lie to us? Why would you think that? Uh, okay, so let's give her this glow fruit. Um, take it. Make me my medicine. I have glow fruit. <laughs> will one be enough? That will do. Give me just a minute. Here just, you go. There's it's just gonna take a minute. Dose, but it's free of charge. Better be. You guys your stupid skull label. Yeah, I fixed your problem because you would have killed people. Well, right? I kept <laughs> you from murdering the town. Because <laughs> someone doesn't put labels on their poison. I just did put labels on the poison. The kids right. took it out. Only enough to fix one house. Yeah, you shouldn't put it next to what each other, I though. Do? Ah, yes. Even with the crystals, there's only so much you can do to help. It appears you must make a decision. Oh no. Oh, Matias, Don't screw this up, no George. What I choose, one of the houses will be ruined. You are a time mage, Chris Bell. Decisions such as this, they will not be uncommon. That's called adulting. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh, this is like Sophie's choice but with houses. Um, I guess I'll give it to who's got the rat again? It was I guess it was her and Well, wasn't it po she's mentioned it to the pocket the apothecary and then the woman with the baby, no? Okay, so yeah, fix your rot in your house, apothecary. Chris Bell, what can I do for you, dear? It has an ash blight infection. It's your shop. It has an ash blight infection. Fix Why don't you give it to the baby? Why would you think the mama that? and the baby? I overheard the car 
Actually, this is kind of, you know what other game this is kind of like is Fable, because Fable was one where you had to make choices like that. Oh, yeah. And it would affect the future. But it was more so with your specific character. Gotcha. Uh, but no, I don't like her. She refers to her baby as it, so I don't trust her. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's what uh, she refers to her baby as if it was like some kind of alien monster. Big fires. Well, no time to waste. We don't have much green leaf tonic, but perhaps I can find another solution. Thank you again, Chris Bell. You're welcome, June. I'm glad I was able to help someone. Oh, save the pocket. Yay! Thing. High five! So now hers is fine, and the other guy has. The other woman has rot with her little baby. <laughs> now the baby's gonna stay in a rotting house. Future? Nice. I suppose. This is gonna be like one of those games where there's like a moral. And it's like you do good things, and good things happen one in the future. At a time, one. Which is a good advice. But... Most of the town remains unchanged. <laughs> Wasn't that like that book, The Secret, that you were telling me that that was the secret, is to do good things, or something like that? The secret is, uh. About we magnetism. Oh. If you do good, good things come to you. If you yeah. think positive, Look, positivity comes to you. That's what brought Ashblade to Nareem the last time. We've got to go. Crispell, wait. Okay, we gotta Such go determination. To the, the farms, I guess, are on fire. Oh yeah, it's coming from this direction, I guess. Uh, oh yeah. So let's see what's happening. Uh, oh goodness. Ooh, it's all on fire. <laughs> it can't be too late. It can't be! Crispell, get out of here! It's goblins! They torched the- Runga! You cut her off! Can do it. <laughs> I can help. She told me to leave! I was about to leave! Time to Don't go! Don't be foolish! Let the soldiers do their work! And pray they're up to the task! That's so dramatic! He sure has uh, confidence on these soldiers! Alright, Wilhelm! By the time you get over there, everything's burnt! Yeah, right? <laughs> well, I do have time travel abilities! Oh. It's like that? I come back like three hours later. Um, do you want to save a powerful enemy? Sure. Uh, powerful enemy. Ooh. It's like I come back three hours later, the entire village is Nash, and I'm like, I figured out my time powers. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's useless. I can save everyone. Oh. Man. It's going to take me another three hours to all figure right, well, out how to go back before yeah. all this happened. Back again? What is it now, Time Age? Goblins are attacking the farms. We've got to do something. Matthias said you could help. Did he? He's right, I suppose. With your talent and my training. Oh, a few years. A few years. Uh, I don't know how long <laughs> a field's going to last before years. it burns down. <laughs> it's like, what are you talking about? Patience. You're a time mage. Try to act like one. We are out of options. There is no other choice. Give her the sword, Wilhelm. Ridiculous. Oh. The frog's got to put his uh, frog legs down. <laughs> I like how he moves his scarf up and down depending on how dramatic he wants to be. He's uh, quarantining and uh, masking. It's like, I think she may have COVID. <laughs> she starts coughing. She's like, <laughs> Be like, uh, did you just cough? Is that like how he talks to himself? He puts the mask on and, and like does a sidebar to himself. Yeah. Hey, Wilhelm, what do you think? <laughs> Whoa. Oh, get the sword. Oh, she changed into another outfit. So wow. I will say the graphics are pretty impressive in this game, um, in the sense that they are very unique. Um, I've never seen too many games with this. You know, they have a very distinct mm -hmm. style and they stick to it. So much it's very vibrant and vivid, like you said. Right, right. Yeah, I just hope they fix the screen tearing because I feel like it happens right at the beginning of the game and it's kind of not, you know, it can kind of uh, taint people's opinions right away, but it actually does look really good. Yeah, it does look pretty great. Well, at least now we got some oh, action going. Time. Oh, okay. It's oh. far between action scenes, that's for sure. Oh, this is where we started the game. Oh, it's coming full circle. Just oh, like a okay, so now we're... Okay. Oh, you can send them around? Oh. Interesting. Invoke future crystal. Let's see. What happens? He got older. Oh. <laughs> I guess so. So, is any attack? Whoa, is that like your spirit? I guess so. I said you my spirit You just had an out-of-body experience? 
Yeah, I don't know if that's good that he's in the future or not. I'm assuming so. <laughs> I don't have any skills yet. Okay. That is so weird. Okay, he's dead. Oh, you got like a timeline on up top. Oh, you, do? you see that? Oh, whose turn? Yeah, uh, yeah. interesting. So we have turn-based combat, another JRPG. We've been playing quite a few of these, right? We had Who are you supposed to be? Christopher. Hello. My name is Tell me if we survive. My name you is Chica Chica some shady. Where he popped out of. Okay. So, uh, I guess I have a lot of crystal power, so I guess I'll invoke the future crystal. Uh, attack him. Take him out. He goes into the future oh, too. I got a critical. Christopher, by the way. I guess so. I guess whoever goes on that side of the screen goes into the future. Cool. Mm. Well, interesting. It's Christopher and Chris Bell. Very, uh, a lot of alliteration here. <laughs> and crystals. They really like that Chris sound, right? Chrissy. Chrissy Teigen makes an appearance halfway through the game. It's like. She does her voice. She lends her voice. She's like, I am Chrissy. How I can help you. I used to be on Lip Sync Title. <laughs> and then I did Mitchells vs. the Machines. <laughs> <laughs> that was a pretty good movie. I guess that using my future powers, how about probably how I take out these sisters. Since I left St. Clary. We've got to stop them before they reach town. And exactly how. Oh, this is kind of like was that other movie we're watching? Uh, Bloodstroke, Blood, Blood, Bloodshot, Bloodshot, Bloodshot. Or it was like repeating. We've talked about this. <laughs> Okay, we got this. Oh, okay. Yes. It's like Groundhog Day where you don't have to uh, keep doing this. I feel stronger. Big mistake. What? Big mistake. Don't let your guard down. I don't trust this. I see. Maybe we could break it the shields work. in the future. Time to have fun. Maybe the shields got aged and they'll break now. Let's see what happens. That's like really. Who said that was a bad do. mistake? Um. Maybe. This is impossible. This isn't working. I'll bring them back to the present. Yeah, I guess that's that, not work. You use your water skill, and I'll try sending them to the future again. Okay. okay. Good thing. I guess they told me what to do. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> I didn't do as much damage as I would have thought. Uh, break future crystal. Boom. Go back. Uh, use your water skill. Water bubble. Water bubbles. Oh, Doesn't I'm seem gonna like rush much. the shields. Is that what's happening? Oh, oh okay. Okay, okay. Let's okay. see if that's true. Let's see. So, oh, so you gotta strategic. be clever in these battles. You know? Oh, these are still my words. Took the words right out of my mouth. <laughs> Have it your way. Careful. They did something to our shield. Are they attached to each other? Or are they just standing uh, next to each other? Huh? They're floating next to each other. But they're not like Siamese twins, where they're like attached. Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> I only see one arm in each of them. Oh, we're actually able to break the shield. Something's happening. Nice. Defense. Maybe down. they're holding up each other, you know, have their arms on their backs. Oh, like, like sisters do all the time. Uh, attack. Destroy them. Destroy them. Yeah, that's so tough now. Oh. The one's wearing like kind of a provocative outfit, right? Um, I mean, they're both wearing like skin tight clothing and some armor. <laughs> <laughs> wearing doing Just the, bits of it too. Doing the Xena Warrior Princess, where they wear armor that's <laughs> very uh, fitted and uh, right. very revealing. Yeah. yeah. I can't have this constricting armor. You gotta be uh, wearing like a leather bikini armor. <laughs> well, at least they're not wearing a skirt. Oh my god, is this thing gonna break yet? Takes time. Seems like they keep getting defense down, so we should. Oh my god, stop it, stop it! Whoa. Jesus. There's a lot there. Can we heal? Uh, do I have an item? Uh, oh, a healing juice. I guess I should Oh use yeah, you that. picked up the healing juice. Oh, there we go. Well, Earlier. that's good news. Uh, okay, let's, let's attack you. Oh, I forgot I can parry. Oh yeah. I forgot that, that was the thing I could do. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Oh yeah, it does a lot less damage if you parry. Okay. That's right. Oh my god. I forgot that they showed you like, oh yeah, press the A button, you can parry. That makes sense. I think if you get the timing perfect, you do more damage too. So there's that like element. Parry! There we go. 
Okay. Well, she's almost dead, so good thing I uh, carried those last yeah. two. You got any more healing juice? Uh, revives an ally with 20% of their HP. I guess not. Uh, okay. I guess we'll just attack. Attack. What? Well, on the bottom, is that their heart level? Their I health? I don't know. Maybe. Uh, it's not depleting. I guess if you do a really good job, you get parry and you take less damage. Oh yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, it's it down is. to three. Yeah, okay. So, okay, we're slowly chipping away at them, but I'm, she's gonna definitely die because she's almost dead. Yeah. She... And they're saying turn up the heat, which means their attacks are gonna get stronger. Wow, okay. Uh, I guess I need That's to... not good. I guess it's my own fault for not remembering I can parry. <laughs> well, first time. Oh, dead. Sorry. Uh, I guess I can use a uh, flask of feathers. Let's see. Feathers. Okay, she's oh, back. I guess she's kind of back. Oh, great. You gotta oh, time it. She's dead. <laughs> Alright, I guess I'll just keep attacking because she doesn't come back with enough health anyway. Yeah, I'm not quite it. getting the timing fully down. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh boy. Christopher, you're gonna have to take him out. Bored now. Bored? <laughs> oh boy. Bored now. Okay, I'm kinda getting the timing down for okay. the parry now. I got This is like one of those music games or something. Like yeah, um <laughs> like Guitar Hero or yeah, whatever. Right? You gotta get the timing just right to get the perfect uh and play um Sweet Child of Mine in perfect timing. <laughs> uh how many hearts you got? Left? Three? She's got three? Uh, she still got three, oh my god. Well, I got critical that time. They're like, one of them would cover their face. You see, they're covering their face. Oh yeah, she's like, uh, this, that's that can't be the hearts, right? This is gonna take forever. I guess that's why I said you have a tough battle coming up. Uh, We're leaving. Why? But I wanna... Enough. The Empress will want to hear of this. Go. Uh, fine. Fine. <laughs> All right, we did it. Uh, wow. Well. I actually did win this time. Yay, you did Sweet. it, victory! Victory is mine, go away. Okay, so... Is that you? You did it! We can't thank you enough! But there's well, still actually, fire. she died. Not it was really she. Christopher that did all the work. Christopher did it. What I've done? You think I brought these monsters to Nareem? I know this was your way of getting the farm. You oh wanted this land for your industrialization project. Ooh. This was all you. Everything I do is for the future of Nareem. For your daughter's future. I would never put anyone at risk. Mayor Anton, if I may divert our focus, this was clearly set up by an unknown party. And on that topic, tell me, Chris Bell. Where did you get that strange uh -oh. sword? None of your business is where. Right. Uh, this was a gift from Mr. Wilhelm and Matthias. Oh, and who are these strangers you seem to know so well? What do they want with Nareem? Is it Jeez. possible? Paranoia. Did they set this up? And are you part of their scheme? Miss Lana, no. We were just trying to help. Oh. Enough, guards. Seize her and the shielded fellow. Okay, who, we'll who's the mayor here? And who's the secretary? Wow. We have to go. What a now, witch hunt. To the cathedral. Wilhelm said he'd meet us there. Uh, okay, I guess we gotta get out of here. <laughs> Time to <laughs> run. Wow, it has another trope where it's you like it. they believe. Really oh, she must be involved, that right? Sword. That's the only way she would be. Well, like, that's why when you were passing by her well in the future, she was wearing and is really. As promised. In the sinister getup, oh. and the mayor wasn't in the picture. In the future, yeah. so she must be involved so because she, why else would she be like yeah. you did this? You? Something. Yeah. Mother Superior, I'm so sorry. Shh, dear. Your interesting new friend here has told us a great deal already. I won't claim to understand all of this, but you're safe. 
That's all that matters. Safe? Maybe for now. She won't stop with Marie. The Empress will keep building up her armies. That monster won't let anything stop her. The Empress? The Empress of Time. A formidable foe, and far beyond our current capabilities. And those idiots in town are too busy pointing fingers to see who saved their worthless skins. <laughs> Run from her if you want. I'll go myself if I... Enough! Don't be stupid, boy. You'll need all the help you can get. Which means, I suppose, mm -hmm. that I'll be going as well. All right, we're getting the crew together. Yeah, party. Going? I can't leave. The orphanage, my... No harm will come to your sisters, dear. Not while I live. Do you see the three faces of the lady? Portrayed in the cathedral's stained glass? Those images foretell a prophecy. A legend which has been Is that like, That's like clearly her, right? Chris Bell? Yeah. The lady. I guess so. She's like, oh, I never noticed. They do look a lot like me. Itself. Yeah, it does kind of look like her. would be able to see into our past as well as the future. I believe that girl is you, my sweet Chris Bell. But I'm no one special. You are special, my dear. Oh my dear. gosh, you're special. You Just admit too, huh? enough <laughs> of this. <laughs> Go to the cathedrals and seek out the other mother's superior. They will help guide you. I know you've always wanted to find your mother, to learn more about your history. Perhaps this is your chance. Your grandmother often spoke of Crystallis. Perhaps the answer lies there. Crystallis. Matthias? Where did he go? He's slippery, that one. Even for a frog. He'll Frogs are there. slippery. Count on mm -hmm. it. The soldiers will be here soon. Quickly, girl. I... Fine. I'll go. But I'll return. I promise. You'd better. Those roses <laughs> Don't think I've forgotten. So okay. I need to put them all in my hat. Alright, like, so we got through the intro of this game. Um, Merciful lady. Oh, I guess it's still talking. She's still talking. <gasps> like, don't interrupt me, George. Shield her. Comfort She's praying. For she has a long road ahead. And when she is finished, O oh great lady, take her gently in your arms and bear her home. Be safe. Uh, that sounds like she's gonna die, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> take her into your arms and take she's her like, uh, I've been saying I don't want this, but if I'm gonna die, I really don't want this. Okay, so we got to the title screen. There goes your intro first look. Yeah, so there's the first look. You can see it's got turn-based combat, puzzle yeah, solving with past and clarity. future. We should try going there uh, next. and some other Just cool like one, elements, art style. By one of the mother's superior. Uh, and maybe we'll play some more of this. It is kind of, I'm kind of well. digging the uh, the art style. So maybe we'll, we'll jump in and play a little more. Okay. Uh, we'll see how we're doing, how I feel about it. Maybe play yeah. a little more on the side too. If you guys Just like this, like and coming. subscribe and give us some feedback. If you yeah, yeah. Like yeah, you want can us to do some more episodes. Yeah, and we'll see you guys in the next episode. Okay. Carry on, my friends. Till Bye. next time. Thanks for watching.